Where we are right now is one of the busiest border land crossings in the world. We're told that over 30,000 people walk through these streets every single day, and a lot of these people are border commuters. They're U.S. residents who commute from Tijuana to San Diego every morning for work. It's Monday morning madness on San Ysidro Boulevard. Trolleys line up ready to take passengers into California. Many of them, like Brenda Cortez, are trying to get to work. I do it every single day for the last year. Cortez lives the transborder lifestyle. She lives in Tijuana and works as a pharmacist in San Diego. For me, it takes about 30 to 40 minutes, and that's from the point that I go out of my house, cross the border and get to my job. The cross border commute is common. Jason Wells with the San Ysidro Chamber of Commerce says a lot of U.S. residents choose to live in Mexico. Because San Diego is so expensive to live in, Tijuana really has become a bedroom community for the workforce in, 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 in San Diego. Every day, over 100,000 people cross over from Mexico into San Ysidro, and they're all tourists. They either cross by foot through this port of entry or by car, which could take up to five hours. As soon as you walk either way, you see lines of thousands of cars just waiting to cross over and you know they start people from two in the morning start making line but wells says for most people it's worth it because for them it's as easy as crossing the street that's what going to mexico is for us we're a binational region we get the best food south and the best clothing clothing north you know we get it's it's we get to enjoy the best of both worlds We've been in California for the past two days, but tonight we're hitting the road and we're heading to Arizona where we'll take a look at the different border barriers along the way. For BorderReport.com tour, I'm Anna Warnicky.